When you don't need an exact answer, rounding is a useful skill to use. To round a number eliminates the less significant digits in plain English, making it more straightforward but keeping close to the original value. In other words, rounding lets you get an approximate number without the desired level of accuracy. In everyday life, rounding is commonly used to make numbers easier to estimate, communicate, or work with. For instance, you can use rounding to make a long decimal number shorter or to report the result of complex calculations or round off currency values. Many different rounding methods exist, such as rounding to the integer, rounding to a specific increment, rounding to a simple fraction, and so on. And Microsoft Excel provides a handful of functions to handle different rounding types. Round is on the primary rounding function in Excel that rounds a numeric value to a specific number of digits. In this worksheet, you can see a data table with an employee's name in the first column and salaries with three decimals in the second column. You want to round these salaries to two decimals, so go to C2 cell and type equal round, press tab, B2, and number 2 for number digits. Remember, you want up to two decimals. Now round function has two alternative functions, round up and round down. Let's try them in the next columns. Type in equal round up C2 and 0 because we don't need decimals. See the result. Do the same in cell E2. Also a nice trick to round a number to the nearest, for example, $100 value, is to type minus 2 for number digits. Let's try it in this empty column. Nice! Finally, if you want to round a number to the nearest multiple number that you choose, you can use mround function. For example, equal mround b2 10. If you have any questions, please post them in the discussion board.